Hey, good afternoon, everybody. Coach Mark Beckton, Coach Bluegrass here with step number four in the process of rethinking, reinventing, and reopening your business. The nine must-dos for your business start racing. So let's go ahead and do a quick recap. Step number one we talked about last week, re-educate and prepare. Get everybody ready. Step number two was rebuild your team, work with your team, help them get confidence, help them fill out their schedule and their plans. What's the interaction with the community? How are we gonna communicate? What are our new standards and protocols? And recognize that it might take a little bit to get up to full productivity. Everything is new to everyone. Step three, renew with deals for days. So we need to renew our relationships with our customer base, with our target market, both our existing customers, our top customers, first responders. If there's something you can do for first responders, do it. And then come try us out. But come up with offers or deals that last for days, weeks, a month. So today let's talk about to do number four, and that's reopening announcements. It's really important to let everybody know what's going on with your business. You know, Napoleon Hill once said, create a definite plan for carrying out your desire and begin at once, whether you're ready or not. Put the plan into action. So reopening us, all about building up excitement. Whether you're getting ready to open or you're already open, you have to re-engage with your community. Get excited, show them you're excited about being available for them. Get them excited about being able to interact with you again, in whatever way that is. Announce every step of the process. You know, if you're open 25%, let them know what that means. Let them know when it's going to be 50%, when it's going to change. Each step along the way, educate, educate, educate what reopening means to you, what reopening means to your team, and what reopening means to your customers. Vendors as well. Get your vendors in involved early on. Let them know what your ramp-up plan is so that they can let you know their ability to support your ramp-up plan if that availability is really necessary and important to you. Reintroduce every team member. Make sure everybody knows, hey, we're so thrilled. We've got Mary back. We've got Jim back. We've got Sally. We've got Tom. Reintroduce them to your team members. Let them remember who they all are. It's been two months or more that they haven't been able to see you. Help them re-engage. Help them remember what's going on. If you've got opening deals like we talked about yesterday, make sure that everybody understands what you have for them. Dates. Make sure they know your dates. Be real clear in your schedule. If you're taking online appointments, explain that process. Let everybody know, here's the plan to reopen. Here's how you can engage with us. Here's how you can connect with us. Here's how you can communicate with us. And then whatever it is that's going on involved, announce it. Announce it, announce it. You can't do this enough. Create a video of getting ready to open up. But let them know everything. It's really important to communicate and let people know you're there because they're afraid, they've got fear, uncertainty, and doubt. You've helped your team get through it. Now we've got to help your client base, your customer base, your current existing clients and your future clients have less fear, uncertainty, and doubt about doing business with you. And the way you do that is you get them involved in your announcement process, in your reopening process, in your ramping up, in your phases. Anything that's going on related to reopening and getting back to normal hours and normal processes, announce it, share it, communicate it. So that's to do number four, reopening announcements. Communicate everything, reteach them all about who you are, who's on the team, what everybody does, and how they can interact with you. Coach Mark with Action Coach Bluegrass joins us again tomorrow when we talk about to do number five, which is redo your celebration.